Alright, well, I guess this is going to be my uh, first video log. Um, pretty much uh, it's just a starter video out because I'll be making plenty of more throughout time. When I do get free time, uh, but I want to actually move on to like playthroughs and walkthroughs and movie reviews on music, all that good stuff. But, you know, that'll happen with time. I'm just doing this one just to give it a little test run. So, uh, well, anywho, um, I know one of the big movies that came out this past couple weekends, well, I guess it'd be just weekend, would be Thor, and, uh, it was, Thor was surprisingly good, um, I know a lot of people were kind of skeptical because, you know, Marvel kind of hit and miss with their movies, but, uh, it was surprisingly good, uh, the cast was also good on that one because a couple actors I had heard from, a couple I hadn't, and uh, it was just a nice surprise, you know, to actually have them fill out the characters properly because the director, Kenneth Braun, um, I watched him when he did Henry VIII, and we had to watch him back in high school with his acting, and he's really good, so it was a nice change with him directing it, and uh, I felt that he stuck more to the mythology overall, which mainly applies to me. Because, I mean, if you think if you're going to do a comic book movie, you should at least, you know, kind of follow pretty closely. And he pretty much got it covered. Uh, not too really many problems with the movie overall. Like, I gave it, when I posted about it, I think like an 8.5 or something like that. But, overall, I mean, I, I'd, I'd go see it. I mean, if you hadn't seen it, I'd really say go see it because it's well worth your time and money. Or you can just, you know, pirate it like most people or wait until DVD, whatever, but it is actually worth watching, especially if you're like me and waiting for the Avengers movie next year, which, you know, 2012, I think they've got a release date right now, but we all know they changed, so I'm not going to say, I'm just going to say 2012, in the summer more than likely. And the only problem I'm having with that movie so far is the fact they have Mark Ruffalo casted to do The Incredible Hulk because Edward Norton was being a pain in the ass about money. I mean, really, if you're gonna, you know, complain about getting paid to make a superhero movie, why did you sign up in the first place? Uh, but, you know, his loss, whatever, I mean, I've watched a couple of Mark Ruffalo's movies, I mean, I'm not gonna bitch about him, I just, hopefully he'll fill out the character good. I thought Edward Norton did a terrific job, but we'll see how Ruffalo picks it up for the Avengers, so it's gonna be pretty big shoes to fill. But they did get Lou Ferrigno to do the Hulk's voice, which I'm like a schoolgirl after I heard that, because that's just amazing. Oh, I feel this video is probably going to be pretty long. I'm going to try to make it as short as I can, because the last thing I want to do is make a 20-minute video of me talking, because you'll probably want to put a bullet in your head at that point. Oh, da -da -da -da. let's see. Um... Oh, yeah, I guess I should go ahead and mention that. Um... I will probably be updating my equipment so, you know, that I can get better quality sound and won't have, you know, that many op interference because I know I'm probably going to get a lot of interference doing this. So, uh, to avoid that, I'm going to be upgrading. I don't know when because it depends on with work and all that fun stuff, as we all know. But mainly my main system I'll be working on is my 360 because, I mean, I had a Wii at one point, but I really don't see that many... Wii stuff where I'm really just not looking for the Wii stuff because I sold mine. And PS3, I'm not going to get a huge war started on this. I mean, some people prefer that, some people prefer Xbox. We're going to leave it at that. I prefer the Xbox. The only reason I would consider getting a PS3 is Kingdom Hearts 3 when it comes out because that was actually a good series and a lot of people, you know, blah, Disney, blah, blah, blah. But you know what? Look past it. It's a good RPG. It's in the numbers. It's in the sales. Just accept it. Anywho, uh, but yeah, mostly 360 games, uh, maybe a couple on my new DS I got because my other one actually died because, you know, I used up all the charges in it and I was a lazy ass to go buy a new battery, so I just bought a new one, you know, you got spare money, you feel like blowing it, so, oh boy, let's see, I'm not sure what my first game would be on the 360 because... I mean, I've got a lot of games on here, um, I mean, I've beat a lot on here too, so, you know, and mine are actually going to be, uh, <clears throat> I 
I guess mainly just, you know, playthroughs because I don't really, you know, it's going to be a lot of videos for me doing a regular walkthrough because finding everything and I'm not like everybody else on here that does that, you know, that they go back and find every little detail and do all that. You see, I just want to play the game and you can hear my funny commentary and a couple of games I will try to do is some Halo matches or stuff with my friends because the commentary on there is pretty damn funny and we've been trying to get one recession recorded but we can't get everybody's work schedule to work because a couple of them are in a band and they travel and other ones are working so we are going to try to get a couple on here and they will be pretty entertaining so just what our, just warning as soon as you see Halo Reach videos or Halo 3 or whatever we feel like playing at the moment those are the ones you're going to want to watch and it's going to be mainly for the commentary because the actual shooting you know we're not like that great like people on black ops like finish games like 30 and 1 or whatever we just you know dick around <laughs> so i mean what's the point of playing a game if you're just going to be serious yeah competition's good and strive to be the best but i mean overall we kind of just buy at least to have fun so why not have fun right Oh boy, let's see. I'm sorry, I keep looking over at that. Over to the side, I'm actually just seeing what else I need to mention in this video. And then I'll go back over and try and edit it out. Let's see. Uh, movies, so I don't, you know, get lawsuits and copyright things out the ass. Um, I won't really be telling any details. I'll just probably be saying, you know, what I liked and saw in it. And, you know, so that way we ain't got all those difficulties because I'm only 21 I don't need this shit right now <laughs> I've got later on in life to get sued by corporations <laughs> oh. and um, I will apologize in advance if I any of my videos get kicked offline or you know while I'm recording on my Xbox or you know just recording these because my internet connection I don't know what's up with it I mean it's been doing good and I switched to wireless and then it's just been going straight to hell. So I have got kicked off at serious times where it actually mattered. Like a lot of my Assassin's Creed online, it takes me. It's been taking me a while to get to the level I have been because I'll actually be on a good run. I've actually been on some like ten and O's and doing great, and then out of nowhere, just disconnect and experience everything else lost. And those would actually have been fun to record because the commentary the whole time it sounds like someone's about to probably get raped <laughs> I mean I know a lot of people are already pissed because I said rape because you know uh, but um, <clears throat> yeah overall yeah, rape's bad don't, don't do it but I will warn you with a couple of my friends the conversations will get violent to the point you think that someone will inevitably say that's not going to happen but maybe after they get offline because I don't really know what they do in their spare time and I'd be kind of scared to find out Oh, and let's see, uh, another thing is the lighting in my videos will probably be very off and on, like in this video you keep seeing the flashing in the background, because I mostly keep my light off because on my side of the house it just heats up so damn quick because the sun always hits it, and I've got my fan going and have my TV on in the dark, and of course y'all know if you've got a giant TV in the dark, you know, what's going to happen? <laughs> Lots of light, so yeah, I've got about a 55 inch right now with just blaring light. So that's why you can tell looking at my wall, it's just changing. <laughs> oh, I think that's actually about it right now covering first vlog, so I mean, I'll try and keep going from here, but yeah, this is just mainly for fun, and I'm actually waiting on the commentary because it's probably like, oh, you're boring, please don't do this, blah, blah. Well, I don't really give a damn. I'm just doing this when I'm in my spare time because I'm actually out for the semester right now and I don't go back till the fall so I'm only really only work really three days a week but I work basically two days in one so now this is just for a free time fun so uh, if you've enjoyed it great if not whatever it's YouTube go watch more stuff but I will try and have more videos up and they will be more entertaining than this you know six hours of sleep you know I'm not very active so all right, well, hopefully there will be uh, more good things to come, and I hope you enjoy my videos to come. So, all right, take it easy, guys.